Dumb Dumb, presented by BSC, Investors Protection Fund. The Election Commission has told the Supreme Court that they are forming an expert committee to look into the issue of NRI voting rights. The Commission is looking at electronic voting through internet for NRIs. Ashpreet Sethi is joining us with more again, uh, more on this. Ashpreet, what are you picking up uh, as far as this, uh, this angle is concerned? Well, yes, as far as NRI voting rights are concerned, the Supreme Court has given an observation saying that though the petitioner has come in at the 11th hour when the election process has already begun, something needs to be done regarding their voting rights. The Election Commission, of course, told the Supreme Court that they have taken a decision of appointing an expert committee to look into the issue. But as far as this election is concerned, there's nothing that can be uh, done. Uh, but uh, the Election Commission also informed the Supreme Court that they are looking at the issue to ensure that during during further elections, whether uh, Lok Sabha or other elections, they are given their rights. Uh, uh, remember, a plea was filed in Supreme Court uh, saying that NRIs have to travel all the way from other countries to India to cast their votes when uh, the plea is seeking that NRIs should be given the right to vote in their respective embassies. Uh, it, the government, of course, told the Supreme Court that 11,400 NRIs are registered, which is why uh, the Election Commission should look at at least uh, uh, easing the process of casting votes for these NRIs. Uh, EC, of course, informed the Supreme Court that they are looking at an electronic mode via the internet uh, by which NRIs will be able to to vote in the near future but the Supreme Court is adamant that they're going to look at the issue on Friday that is April 11th and decide whether uh, how an interim arrangement can be done for voting of NRIs during these elections. Countdown presented by BSC Investors Protection Fund.